Today, I will be talking to you about a recent paper published by our group entitled, A Novel Approach to the Basophil Activation Test for Characterizing Peanut Allergic Patients in the Clinical Setting. In this pilot study, we evaluated the feasibility of a novel peanut basophil activation test that aims to preserve basophil activation for several days post-stimulation, allowing for a delayed flow cytometry. Basophils from subjects with confirmed peanut allergy and negative controls were stimulated with increasing peanut concentrations and processed with the novel basophil activation test reagents. Basophil activation was then detected by flow cytometry on days 0, 1, 3, and 5 post-test. Results show the mean AUC of the subject's activation responses demonstrate activated basophils for up to 5 days post-stimulation and there was no significant decrease in the activation signal for up to three days post the test. The day five AUC for patients was slightly but significantly lower than day zero. Samples from the same patient generated similar dose response patterns on different days as demonstrated by the functional principal components and intraclass coefficients demonstrate excellent consistency among the various tools used to measure reliability. Overall, the novel BAT basophil activation test method is clinically important as samples can be prepped in a real-world clinic setting and in time sent out to dedicated facilities for more complex analysis with reliable results, unlike many conventional basophil activation test methods, which can be difficult to pursue in non-research settings.